Hey guys, welcome back here to my channel. This is Paula with Flumina Pachis and I just wanted to release a quick word about what uh, Esther's, just this is for Esther's. This is a public service announcement. The spirit of the Antichrist, the spirit of Haman is rising. The Lord has been speaking to me. It makes sense that we're in an Esther time, a, a, a time uh, a, a rising of a people for such a time as this, it makes sense that the Antichrist spirit is manifesting. So the Lord showed me uh, a bear in the form of a, a, like, a likeness to Daniel chapter 7 verse 5 where Daniel has a prophetic journal entry and he talks about this bear that has like three ribs inside of its mouth and like uh, very, you know, just um, it's it represents the Medo-Persian Empire and it represents a type of Antichrist. The other morning I woke up and I saw the 666. First thing I saw in the morning, I was like, way to wake up, you know. <laughs> but yeah, that's what I saw. The Lord is speaking to me about the Antichrist spirit. And I'm like, God, what is the Antichrist spirit up to? Like, what's going on? And I prophesied this earlier um, for my prophetic word in 2023. I said, the spirit of the Antichrist shall rise in this year. That's a word I have that has not come to pass, I don't believe. Um, of course, the, we see things escalate, but it's not like a total blatant like Antichrist spirit in like pockets of the world. So um, that's happening watch out for the spirit of Haman because a lot of uh, women, a lot of people who are in this Esther season of their lives that were delivering this baby um, of revival and all those kind of exciting times and things, Haman is also building. That's what the Lord said. The, the, the Antichrist spirit is building. And I see the, the, the bear standing with its prey with something in its mouth. I didn't, I didn't quite see what it was, but I saw that it was either a prey or like representing symbolically of territory, of land, of a people, of a group. And I was disturbed, you know, it had, it carried, this, this vision carried a prophetic weight on me. And so I pressed into it later on in the day and the Lord began to show me the hands of this bear were cut off and he had like the hooks of a pirate. And and it makes sense, like this Antichrist spirit is like stealing, it's stealing land, it's taking people hostage. Um, I feel like there's gonna be sudden deaths, sudden disease, uh, uh, be, especially because that Daniel chapter seven, verse five, it says this bear was ordered to kill to destroy people to to devour its prey um but i but here's the thing here's the sto here's the spoiler alert is that i see this these hands i see them arrested i see them handcuffed i see them bound in the name of jesus i see them bound and so i just hold on to that word because that's that's what we're coming after that's that's why esther's going to rise esther's going to rise to save the day she's going to rise to um to for such a time as this and this is a time we're in i see the spirit of the antichrist and i just wanted to put that word out there to just you know tell you what i'm seeing you know i'm a watch i'm on my watchtower i'm listening i'm praying i'm excited for this land you know i suck at it sometimes and then i get right back on and i just encourage all of you to keep persevering persevere okay so i sat on that video that i just uh, showed you um I sat on that for a little bit and I hadn't released it and I'm just re-watching it over. And today the Lord confirmed exactly that word. So sudden death, I, I prophesied sudden uh, death. Uh, I'm hearing about cancer coming back to people in my life. I'm hearing about a lot of fear. The banks began to collapse and this is a timely uh, prophecy about the wealth transfer. I've been prophesying about that. I even, like, I don't, I, I hate being that prophet, like putting timelines up like that because you really put yourself at risk. <laughs> you really, you know, have to trust God with timelines. And it's happening exactly the, 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 
in the time frame that the Lord told me. And, you know, I'm, I'm a baby prophet. You know, I haven't been doing this for a long time. Like the Lord is just um, confirming. He's confirming the spirit of the Antichrist. And I just want to come on here, add to that video and just share a little bit more specifically, like what this spirit is. And the spirit of the Antichrist right now, the way it's manifesting is fear. It's straight up fear and disease. And it it is commanded to kill you. They want to kill you. They want to destroy the economy. And then they want to come and save you. You know, be careful, you know, when, when the Fed and, and I'm sorry, like all these, <laughs> the people in charge, you know what I'm talking about. They want, they want to control you and they want to feed you and they want you to be their slave. That's what it comes down to. They want to enslave a people and that's what's happening. And this is why God is going to step in through Esther, the Esther rising, the Esther anointing. Esther is going to submit your, herself. And, and again, I want to reiterate that the spirit of Haman, that antichrist spirit, I see it being dragged out. I see it being dragged out in the name of Jesus. So I just declare that yes, there is gonna be fear and yes, there's gonna be a lot of scary things happening right now um, in this season. But guess what? Our God is so much bigger than that and you and I need to partner. This is a time to fast. We do need to fast to drive this evil spirit out. We do need to partner in that Esther fast, we we need to do that. So it's not just going to happen out of nowhere. We have to partner with the Word of God. So uh, I just wanted to clarify, be a little bit more specific that God is confirming this word in my life and what I'm seeing out there as well. So God bless you this week. Hang in there and I'll see you on the next video.